it's Luca. So today I'm going to be doing a little bit of a different video and you may have not been expecting this from me if you don't follow me on social media but I felt that I should speak about what recently happened at the Ariana Grande concert and I felt like I really needed to make a video because it was something that really spoke to me and not necessarily in a good way or a bad way it was just something that was really different um, from the previous tragedies that has happened I haven't really seen any youtubers for the most part talk about it and I feel like if someone is going to talk about it might as well be me and I'm not saying that I'm the only youtuber that's talking about it just from what I have seen I am a huge fan of Ariana Grande if you don't know, I have like a poster of her hanging up in my closet and a picture of her on my bulletin board. I have her perfume. I'm a big fan, so just to see something this horrific happen happening in relation to her is terrible and just in general terrible because of how many people attended that concert thinking they were gonna have a fun time. And the reason I am doing this video is because I feel that I have a platform and I love using my platform to make you guys laugh and and I hope that you guys look forward to my videos. Um, I hope that it makes your day a little better. I really work hard for you guys, but at the same time, I feel like I can use my platform in a much bigger way than just beauty and fashion sometimes. And I felt like when this happened that I needed to speak out because a bunch of you guys really care about what I have to say. The first thing I just want to say is my love and support goes out to all of the families affected. If you went to that concert, I can't fathom, like I personally can't fathom how that must have felt like. can't believe that there was an attack at a place that should be filled with happiness, a place that you go to to have a great night with your friends, where families go to to have a great night. The lives that were lost is just so unbelievably tragic and again, please just pray for those families who have lost their kids or who have lost someone they know but at the same time this has all really united us together and just scrolling through twitter the amount of love that ariana and all of her fans are giving her and everyone who attended the concert is amazing and it really shows it showed me how powerful social media can be when it's used in a good way it's just amazing to see all the support that everyone's giving each other and it really just like shows how situation so terrible we as humans can come together and say you know what this is not going to change the way we lives our live our lives and it shouldn't change the way that you live your life when i first heard about it i kind of was in shock a little to the point where i didn't want it to really sink in i know maybe you guys are kind of like that and whenever you hear something that's just crazy um tragic sometimes that can be a little selfish but um i definitely did that when i first heard the news i kind of didn't want to think about it then i really thought luca you have to really think about what seriously happened and after that it just kind of like took a toll on me and i started really looking through twitter and seeing all of just the support and it was really beautiful seeing um the whole ariana fandom coming together and everyone else whether you're a fan of her or not i think we can all agree that what happened was terrible and that we need to make this bad situation good in some way by spreading happiness and being kind to each other living every day like it's our last because you never know what's gonna happen tomorrow and it's sad that we live in a world where you don't know what's gonna happen tomorrow you don't know if you're going to still have the people around you in a week I, if there's one thing that you guys take by this video is that please just live every day like it's your last because life is so amazing for you to just be worried about people that want to plant terror into our minds and it's not fair if we give in to that and as soon as we give in to that fear and kind of stay away from concerts, stay away from places that are heavily populated just because we're afraid that something terrible might happen again is it's not fair to us and we shouldn't live our lives like that. I began to think this could have happened to me and this could have happened anywhere. Me and my mom actually went to her concert in Orlando and Orlando has previously 
experienced tragic events. I don't want to revolve this around me thinking that people lost their lives. I could have lost mine too. I could have known people who lost their lives and I don't personally know anyone that lost their lives or I don't know anyone who attended the concert because I live in the US but again if you know anyone I'm so deeply sorry. I can never feel what those people were feeling in that moment but I can't help them and I'm going to link a GoFundMe down below for you guys if you want to donate. You don't have to donate a hundred dollars but um twenty dollars ten five a dollar fifty cents anything please just just help whatever you can do to help these people i would greatly appreciate it and i know they would too so if you end up donating anything please send me a screenshot and tweet it to me or leave a comment down below i'm just trying to get back to these people and, and i know a lot of you guys might be scared you could be the opposite and not particularly think much of this why this is really different than something that has previously happened before is that this was a concert. It was a place where nobody was expecting it. I mean, I can remember going into the concert and thinking like, well, this is really not organized. There was lines that were, people were just kind of shoving each other. It was very crowded. Whenever you go to something that is unfamiliar, like a concert or the movie theater, please just be aware of what's around you. Take your eye off your phone and just soak in everything that's happening around you. A lot of times we think that it will never happen to us, so like why even pay attention? Be aware of what's going on around you because it could happen to you and it could happen to me. And it's just really important that we stay positive together. It's going to be okay. I wish I didn't have to think that this could happen again tomorrow, but we can stay aware. This is such a tragic situation. I wish this wouldn't have happened and it is so true. It is so tragic and I, I wish this didn't happen, but we have to take some positive out of this and really, really think that we can either let this hurt us and let it scare us or we can take it as a moment to just really connect with the world then in ways that we haven't before. I know with social media it's very easy to reach out to those in Manchester, those across the world. I live in Florida and just knowing that I have the ability to reach you guys by posting a video um, around the world I think is really cool and I think we should use that to our advantage. I'm gonna end it there on a positive note. Please leave me a comment down below if you end up donating. I know we will never know exactly what those people are going through but we can't help them out so if you would like I will leave the link down below. Um, it would make me really happy if you decide to donate. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!